Rack rebuilds are nothing new in the face of railroading. Often, you might not even know that the unit was involved in a wreck. But sometimes, that's not always the case. Union Pacific 7312 is probably the most notable case of an unusual wreck rebuild, and it's definitely noticeable. 7312 was built in 1998 by General Electric as one of the many new AC6000s by the Union Pacific. In her early years, her life went normal, handling freight across the west coast. However, 7312, like most of the AC6000s on Union Pacific, suffered a lot from mechanical problems regarding their engines. A bit of small trivia, 7312 is one of the UP's many convertible AC6000 CWs. And as a result of this, 7312 was reclassified as an AC4460 CW. In 2004, 7312 would derail while on Norfolk Southern trackage, resulting in the cab suffering major damage. Instead of sending the big engine back to home territory for repairs, Union Pacific sent the locomotive to Ennis's Juniata shops to be repaired. The most notable change from this rebuild was, well, the cab, which in typical NS practice, the headlight was in between the number boards instead of the nose. The locomotive was returned to UP after the repairs, and has continued to operate for UP into today. Despite being derated in 2017 and receiving the iconic flag scheme, she still has her NS-styled cab to this day. Because of her unique rebuild, she had gained a cult following in the rail fanning community, which has resulted in multiple model kit bashes of her in various forms. Sometimes a unique appearance is what catches the eye. Don't take this out of context.